10 gallons of fluids in one trip. That's a lot of fluids in one trip. That's a lot of weight to carry all at once. My goodness gracious. There's your exercise for the day, huh? I, I've just... I've just told Meep that I can't play with him anymore. I don't think he has uh, understood that yet. <laughs> but, uh, all right, Kronk, let me give you a call. I was prepared, and then Meep was like, please, please play with me, please, human. And I had to. Colin Kronk. Let's get Kronk in here. Let's get the game loaded up. Are you there? Nobody here but us chickens. Ah, shoot. I was looking for... I was looking for Krunk... Spleen. You pronounce it Spleen. Right? Correct. I got it. I got it. Um, but if there's only chickens available, I suppose I'll have to play with chickens today. Uh, chickens, are you... Are you capable of, uh, playing the game outward? As long as it doesn't involve long periods of flight, yes. It doesn't. You can't even jump. So we're all Beautiful. set. <laughs> have you got have you got your breath back? Oh yeah. Okay. I haven't done any exercise today. I've been trying to exercise every day. Open game to friends. Uh, let's call it ten gallons with a big G. That'll be the oh, that's right, I have to click the OK button. That'll be the name. In, in celebration of all this exercise you've just done. Oh, it's so bright here. I like it. Oh, my stupid face, I forgot. I'll put my mask back on for now. There we go. Much better. Whew. I'll get started connecting. So we came all the way to the desert last time. Yeah, we did. With new weapons. Right! That's right, we killed the thing. You got the fancy uh, dagger, and I got the creepy hand mace. Hello. Hello. Do the yes, Minecraft you got hello. The ice mace. I got the fire dagger. <laughs> Meep is so mad that I'm not playing with him anymore. I'm sorry, Bob. After the stream, okay? Am I a bad cat owner? Might be. Yes. Wait, no. <laughs> no, I, I don't think I'm I'm a bad cat owner, but I'm a I could be better. Hey, what's up? You need something, buddy? Excuse, that was rude. No, I just wanted to walk real slow. <laughs> just wanted to shove me, like really slowly. And why are people walking through the bushes? This is hi. Can we help you? We started a trend. <laughs> it's like. Like when they, they make parks and stuff and they lay out the, the paths on right angles and people are like, I'm not going to walk all the way to the end there and they go across the grass anyway. Except in this case, there's not really any reason for it. I don't think. It's a very narrow strip of grass covered in bushes to be pushing your way through. Almost like a forest. There we go. I'm hiding. No one can see me. No, no, we've seen forests. Forests have uh, three large trees spread out over... There's another one. What are you people doing? Oh, scantily clad. Not complaining, just... Okay. <laughs> what did we come here to do? We came here to, like, buy skills and stuff. Buy skills and farm money to buy more skills. Farm money to buy more skills. We have... We did spend most of the money. There's three gold ingots... Those little yellow triangles on things bother me, especially since I think it's supposed to indicate a new item, but I've had these items for ages. Yeah, every time I, I log in. This game, I'm telling you. Flawless, no glitches at all. How you doing? You hide in the bushes too? We started, we have started a trend. We're trendsetters, we're very popular. Mm-hmm. It's probably because of my mask. Both of our masks, really. We are impressive. We are. Very impressive indeed. What's up? Hey, you got the same mask as me. What's up, buddy? Mask bros. Who are you? Baron Montgomery. Don't have time to chat. 
Interesting. Oh, he's a dick. Oh, okay. Well, I don't care if you don't have time to chat. I hate you. I trust I trust my traveling companion to say that you're a dick, so... Oh, man, is this mask tainted now? No. It takes more than one douchebag to disgrace such a beautiful mask. I like your I like your thinking. That works for me. Look at you're holding this hammer so badly. You get it. <laughs> tap 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 tap. <laughs> <laughs> it's not how a hammer works. That's the whole purpose of the hammer is the lever. You gotta hold the down the other end. Otherwise, why are you using such a large hammer? Maybe it's because this is the Three Brothers Smithy, and there's one dude here. <laughs> there's a lot of things wrong with this place. Like this ever-pouring sword mold? Yeah, that's another thing that's wrong here. Which for some reason also, also we need to call the... OSHA about this nonsense. Come on, guard. Look at this. It's a fire hazard. There's a carpet on the ground, right next to these flying sparks. This entire place is a safety hazard. I forgot how low my graphics settings were, so that I don't get lag on the stream. The bushes just become blobs from this far away. <laughs> it's fine. We don't need the graphics to be fancy. Mm -hmm. Amy, are you getting into trouble to punish me for not playing with you anymore? Play with you after the stream. Oh, this drama over here. Cat drama. I'm hiding. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I can see your health bar. <laughs> I might not have noticed you if it weren't for your health bar, to be honest. And the large compass pointer. Yeah, also that. Well, I mean, I would have figured out where you were, but I wouldn't necessarily have spotted you. Anyway. Anyway. Um, I oh, think we have purchased okay. what skills we could purchase. And I think we discovered that I've already used up all of my, my breakthrough points, which I did not realize was even yes. possible. What did I... Uh, if you open your menu, mm -hmm. there's a skills tab. Yep. And... The breakthrough skills will be passive. So you have to go to the next tab down with the circle. I got a lot circle. of passive skills. Like Feather Dodge is one you have that's right. definitely a, a key skill. This isn't going to about this. I think Fitness may have been one of them. No, because I have fitness. Wait, I have fitness as well. Why don't I just look up which skills are... Could do that. Breaker. We could just wiki it. I mean, not that it really matters at this point, although it would be good to, to remember which uh, trainers I would need to go back to to get the rest of my skills. I tried to make fizzy apple juice, and it turned out that the fizzy water was not fizzy anymore. And now I'm sad. That's That's terrible. It was just the last of it. I, I bought a new fizzy water today. Is that survive? Is that one of the top right survivors' resilience? Yes. Okay, survivors' resilience and steadfast ascetic are both uh, breakthroughs as well. Okay. What was the third one? This one, feather dodge. Yeah. I do love my rough. feather dodge. Oh, baby, look at this! Look at this! Love it. Check me out. So you are a hunter, warrior, monk, rogue. Okay. Wait, rogue? Rogue is the one that we went to last In time. In the slums here. That I, I couldn't buy the breakthrough skill because I don't have the point. No, that was uh, uh, this dude up here. Oh, okay. The mercenary. Oh, right, right, right. I knew that. I was just ch testing your memory. So I can't become a mercenary. So I can't buy anything else from this guy. Oh, right, because I said I wasn't interested in guns. Correct. 
And the only the only other ones I would really have is shield. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. That I wouldn't have taken that one then. Are you carrying your back? Oh, did you get it too? Yep, I Yay. need it too. Because now wonderful. I am a trap specialist. You should see some of the crazy ass traps I can use now. I hope I will. And you will. <laughs> <laughs> Awesome. All right, where where are we going now? We're gonna we're gonna grind. How many how many skills do I have left to even buy at this point? I don't know. Do you want to run by the rogue trainer? See what? I think I got everything since... I could from the rogue trainer, didn't I? Well, you have the stealth, which is the top tier one. It's the last of the non dagger skills. Let me go take a look. Won't take long. Burning through all my dang stamina, though. Check me out with my memory. It's this way. Yes. Yeah, no, that's it. Everything else is... Or I, I mean, I guess I could... Can I get these... If they're on the same level as one I already have? Wait, I have backstab? Yeah, it's only no. I do. It's only the two that are like attached. Oh, okay. And so I explicitly could get... say once you get this, you can't get the other. I could get sweep kick, but I don't need it. Because I already have too many <laughs> fighting skills yeah. and not enough hotkeys. Could do pressure plate training, I guess. It's only fifty. Yeah, but I if you, these are the dagger, one, the skill so... you can't get at the, the top is pressure plate expertise. Ah, okay. It doesn't really make Which much sense for me to use. get. I'm not going to play this by myself. This is our playthrough, so it doesn't really make sense for me to spend money on a skill that you already have, right? Correct. In which case, I have everything I need from this guy. The rest is dagger stuff, which I'm not using, and a kick, which I don't think I need. Yeah, I'm not getting the kick either. Um, I do want Serpent's Parry eventually all right so we can grind up i've got three gold bars now so if we get another 200 you can get that right assuming oh yeah how, how it's a 600 it? 600 okay so we need 300 more so should that be our goal for today yeah why not that way we can be done with this city until we get sent here by <laughs> until we have to we can be done with this place until we need to come back to it that sky is so beautiful. You know what that means? It's time to adventure at night. Again? How do we keep doing this? Look at all our glowy stuff. We just appreciate. Little white dots. Bluish white dots coming off the back of me. I'm powered by sulfur farts. This is true. <laughs> <laughs> nice. All right, I'm where sure. where do we grind here? Last time we came here, we Dance were we were floor. way over our heads. So, did we go fight? I don't sand think shards? you heard my joke. Oh, and I didn't. Please say it again. You said, "Where do we grind here?" And I said, "The dance floor." <laughs> this clearly is the dance floor right here. You just boogie. <laughs> As a big move. We're gonna rave. If we're gonna rave. We have to do this proper. Low sticks. Oh yes. <laughs> Like, my shoulders shrug up whenever I use my shield from a squatting position. I like it. And meanwhile, these two are having a stoic debate wordlessly. <laughs> we got shirtless man judges. holding a ham hawk. Did you see this guy? He may not be wearing a shirt, but he does have his meat. Big, 
Big slab of meat. It's not even cooked. Nope. You on your way to the barbecue? I feel like one surefire way to kill the immersion of this place is to take, pick an NPC and follow them around and then see what loop they go in. <laughs> and at what point they vanish after walking into a wall for a while. <laughs> Alright, uh, now that we've done that, that bit of empath. grinding, what about the... Uh, I want this dude's thing? hat. Hmm? Look at this dude's hat. Ooh. Fancy. So like gold leaf feathers. It looks heavy, to be honest. And again, I'm wearing a metal mask. What, what, what right do I have? We are we are both wearing metal masks of various <laughs> non-humans. I gotta make sure I do some exercise after we finish the stream. I'm trying really hard to get into the habit of exercising every day. And I've been doing kinda good, but then uh, I'll be tired one day and I just won't exercise. And I need to make sure I do anyway, even if I'm tired. Yeah, the days you don't want to are the days you really gotta. Yeah. So usually we find bandits to kill for money. Let's see. Oh, I know there are bandits it's here. Time, so I can put on some proper armor. Apparently it's still cold, my goodness gracious. So I know there are some bandit style dudes around <laughs> cut to 30 minutes from now why do i have all this burnt stamina yeah no kidding <laughs> i've already got a whole bunch like an eighth of my stamina burnt off i'm sure i won't regret that there's a dude is that a bird Yep, it's a red bird. Is that bird gonna kick our asses? Only one way to find out. I'm trying to lock onto it. I need to get so close to lock on. Well, presumably it won't be hostile unless we attack it or get too close. All right. Uh, you want me to aggravate it so you can backstab? Well, I just thought it would be best to be on opposite sides. Probably a good call. Oh, it's running away. Oi! Get back here! Yep. <laughs> Bye! Bye. Have fun. We'll miss you. We'll get you later. Oh, Gary. That, did, that didn't go well at all. <laughs> I really hate this fucking light. <laughs> it's a little annoying. See, all I have to do is look away from you and it's fine. That doesn't help you very much, though. I guess. There. Well, there's some butterfly spots. Good to know. Awfully close to the town. Wait, I don't see them. Oh, because my graphics are turned all the way down. <laughs> you will have to be my eyes. Are these gay berries? They are in the middle of a desert. Look at that. Well, in an oasis, I suppose. I mean, we do have this tiny, tiny little river. Exactly. What's that blue thing? Is that salt? Uh, looks like it. Yep. And it's mine. Oh, I'm cold. Son of a... Um... Protects against the cold. Alright, I'm good. Where's my ice thing? Oh, there we go. Oh, the torch replaced my... What's going on? There we go. I'm having inventory problems. Wait, why am I cold again? I just drank that tea. 
I guess I yeah, have to carry yeah, yeah, yeah. a torch. Should have brought my winter gear. Iron. Rich iron. Mining pick broke. So that's that. So next time next time we sleep, you gotta equip it and then repair. Or just wait until we find another one. One or the other? Both this is a me. thing. Is it? River's End. All right. Could possibly go wrong. We're heroes. Hello, Elvira, Demon Queen. It'd be fine if you have a torch and a tea. That was the only tea uh, that I had. <laughs> Although I can get Croak to make me some more. Croak, you'll make me more tea if I need it, right? Uh -huh. All right, in any case, in here, oh. we don't need We have mantises. Is, is. Uh oh. Uh, you missed me. Ow. Crap. I wanted to capture its lightning. There we go. Sheesh. I wasn't prepared for an immediate fight. <laughs> oh, she's right. Uh, Gayberry Tartine and Gayberry Jam protect against cold, I believe. Oh, I don't think I have any. I just have one berry. Keep that in mind. Uh, I'm down to like half health. I got my butt kicked by that shrimp. And you got the purple curlies. I got the purple curlies. What's that one again? Confusion. Confusion is not that bad of a an effect in this game. <laughs> I'm used to confusion meaning like your controls get reversed or something. What we got? Anything good? Old lantern, some oil, bandages, crab eye seed, and a cooking pot. Well, we don't need most of that. I'll take the oil, I guess. I don't think the lantern or anything sells for much, right? I don't believe so. But there is a skill called Throw Lantern that does a fair amount of fire damage. I do not have that skill. Is that it? I mean, all we had to kill was one mantis. I suppose. What time is it? Middle of the night? Yes, it is 1 a.m. How do we always manage to do this? <laughs> oh, this water's clean as well. Well, it was. Did we left a dead mantis shrimp in it? Yeah, this, the shrimp is up on the sand. It's fine. Get confusion and heavy already take more damage than normal. Oh, interesting. Are we going out? Yeah, the, I'm paying that attention. Is temperate if we decide to take a nap. Although our our tents, I think, help against the cold a bit. Not as much as the fur tents, but we get better stamina from it. Our tents are fancy and nice. Actually, we don't have a sleep buff right now. Should we like? You said there were some butterflies nearby. Yep, other side of the river. Should we just take a quick nap? Get our burnt stamina back. Certainly. But Why am I having so much trouble getting that? To e you have to remember to equip your mining pick. Right, I will. And put down my backpack like an intelligent person. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Whee! Nothing more satisfying. <laughs> Can roll all we want now. We're about to sleep. Sweet. Okay. Quit. And drop the backpack. And let's get some daylight. I have the proper gear. Did you equip the pickaxe? That's gotta be good enough. 
I have the proper gear for the heat. I don't have the proper gear for the cold. I forgot to that at night. The desert get cold. Hey everyone. At night the desert gets real cold. So you need both types of equipment. Yes, because there's no water to act as a thermal insulator. Right. Now I need to put my hot weather gear on. Man, even with my hot weather gear, now it's too hot. <laughs> Honestly. That pick is ah, a little more than half repaired. That's fine. What do I got against the heat? Not much. Drinking water, I guess, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that helps a lot. Does going in the water help? Not at all. That's I stupid. was joking. <laughs> it should. It should help. Alright. Let's see. I remember there were the sand sharks, and they kicked our asses pretty good last time. Okay, uh, we need to find you a cactus. Oh, right, that gives you the uh, protection from the heat, right? I remember. Cactus over here. That's right. Yes. I got another ochre spice beetle. How do I always get beetles every time? All right. I don't know how long that effect will last, but we're good for the moment. I wonder if we should just, um, there was the underground area below the city where there were some bandit dudes, right? Yes. That's should we the other go side of the there city. to grind for cash? And we don't have to worry about the heat, right? That is true. Now that we've taken all these steps to protect ourselves against the heat. Do you ever play um, A Tale in the Desert? Do you remember that game? I spent so much time in A Tale in the Desert. <laughs> I feel like I'm the only person on Earth who remembers it. I'm glad that's not the case. Like, oh lord, do you remember like the big old trains to get the different, like, I forget if it was martial arts or something skills that... I never like, got very far. You had to learn far. poses from other people and... I remember, I remember there being a moment where I was like, this game is awesome. And I was, not ripe. I was like, I will pay the fee to play this game. Cause I couldn't play any other MMOs cause of the money. But I cared enough, like this was one that wasn't about fighting. And I was like, oh, finally, I'm gonna invest the money, the little money that I have in this. And then it turned out that in order to do remotely well in that game, you had to spend like eight hours a day playing it. Mm -hmm. And I didn't have eight hours a day. So I would go on and I would, you know, grind a little bit. And I wasn't really playing with anyone. So I wound up not getting very far. Every time I logged I in, I remember like the whole world had changed. And I'd be like, what? I, uh... I, I got I pretty up good at the blacksmithing mini game thing i have vague memories of that i remember i used to run around gathering materials because that was one thing that you could do without needing to invest a ton of time and it was kind of a pain for higher level players to do but even that i just didn't play enough to ever make any real progress but even though i never played very much of it it still sticks out in my memory because it was like the first time i think i had ever found an online game that wasn't about fighting and killing stuff yeah, I think I have a, I know at one point I had a t-shirt, but Lord knows how long ago that was. Huh. It was kind of an expensive one too. Like the subscription. 
It was like $15 a month or something, compared to like $5 a month or some other ones. I tried to play that. The other one that I played was uh, Dranzik. Which is another obscure one, I guess. Hello? Oh, we got people. Oh, quick. Are they coming for us? Oh, no. Nope. Eh, kinda. Slowly. So no, there's nobody up here, right? No. Alright, yeah, he's coming. You don't need to drop your backpack anymore, man. Too bad. I wasn't even paying attention to my health or anything. <laughs> yeah, she's just got mana stuff. All yours. Yeah, you don't need to drop your bag anymore. You gotta get out of that habit. Oh, there's another dude down there. Oh, quick reminder. This cave is temperate, so you can put your good stuff on. Oh, good point. Thank you. You don't look magic. Ooh, you're jumpy though. Backstab him. I can't. He, when he was jumping, he was jumping away from my backstab. Unfortunately, I have put so many debuffs on him, I can no longer see him. <laughs> oh. oh, another guy coming. You're all jumpy. Look out. Alright. There's another guy coming up the slope. Okay, he's not coming at us yet. Iron spikes on this one for your traps. Uh, Ooh, that reminds me. Bandage up. Goodness. That guy might be on his way. <clears throat> I gotta remember my abilities, too. Hey, buddy. Is it armed? Yeah. Okay. Lead him down here. Yeah. Oh! Aim for me. He's on fire! He still got a hit off. And then I used the wrong skill. Aw. I forgot about my skills again. <laughs> I'm a hero! I'm a hero at half health. good food for this area. Elemental resistance. I guess I'll take it. Really just want to heal. Okay. Still got rage, and I keep forgetting to use it. Onward. No, outward. <laughs> Downward. That's what this game should be called. Inward. Oh, I remember being here. And there were the elemental guys in there. Yep. That you killed through the... Yeah, there they are. Hey, buddies. How you doing? Oop. Apparently they can hit me. Hehe. <laughs> Nobody else down here, right? I don't think so. I made a boo boo. What happened? I let myself get personed. 
Oh dear. I killed one guy. Stop blocking. I'm trying to kill you. Come on, guys. There you go. Oh, did that not work? Oh no, I ran out of mana. Oh no. I need to go eat somebody's souls. Right? Or yep. is that for HP? I'm gonna go snack. Well, I use mana to return some non-burnt HP. And then I eat their souls to regain the mana. Gotcha. These guys are kind of just doing a little dance in there at this point. Come on, guys. There you go. Got one hit off. Oi, Jesus. Where? Is it just hitting them immediately? Mm -hmm. Nice. Oh, two down. Come on, buddy. Lock him. Like a jerk. Oh, I thought you were done attacking. Just got hit for no reason. I need to get a bow again. Fight me, Jimmy. Look out! Nope, I successfully blocked. Okay. I thought. I didn't even go off taking some damage. Hi, Jimmy. Guy is tenacious. There we go. Oh, we got stuck in the bars. <laughs> He's just slowly falling over. <laughs> Alright. How come the doors are closed? We opened them last time we were here. <sighs> I keep getting nervous whenever we... Go into the water. Because I've been playing Vintage Story constantly. <laughs> and if you go in the water in Vintage Story and you're carrying a torch, your torch goes out. There's a skeleton over here if you need another snack. I do. And some spikes in the chest there. I guess that's about it. <laughs> there was more to this place, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's a path we haven't taken. Okay. I believe you. Is it in here? No, this was just a dead end, wasn't it? Yeah. I know there's the trap door up above. It opens into there. Oh, that's right, it's down that way. So getting into that cage was from up here, because we came from the other direction last time. Yeah, here. This is trap door. Which I guess I can just go down. Are you in the upstairs upstairs or the middle upstairs? I'm going through the trap door. <laughs> I'm on the other side. I'm just looting these dudes. There's a skeleton in here too. I don't know how you're doing on snacks. I'm gonna open the door. So you can come in if you want. 
There's I multiple could skeletons use in here. Another sacrifice. What's going on? I heard the word sacrifice. Yes, that's. I could use another one. There's uh, several of them in here. And then there's traps here, which I'm avoiding deftly. Ooh, gay berry tartine. A couple of wool shrooms. A couple of live witty. Just taking everything. Can I pick this up? There we go. Alright, so there's a tunnel over here. Uh, that one. There we go. Oh, that's right. We can't get up there. I think that's from this other direction. Careful. There are traps in this hall. You must avoid them deftly. If you're not going to be deft about it, there's not even any point. There's another uh, skeleton. I remember being here. I remember thousands of years ago. I uh, need to go the other path. One second. Someone is knocking at my door. Oh. Better go answer it then. Could be important. Might have been a mistake. Eh, there's nobody in here. That is just, just so nasty. They've made such a mess with all the tomato juice. It's just, oh god, it's everywhere. They strained it. Increases your frost damage and resistances. I'll take that. Give you want this uh, hackmanite? Oh, overweight yes. bag. How you doing on uh, on weight? Should I pass some stuff off overweight. to you, or are you overweight too? I'm at seventy nine point nine out of seventy five. Okay. <laughs> well, we can head back. I just won't pick up anything else that's uh, not valuable. I'm not that over. Fine, I'll wait here. Hmm? I said fine, I'll wait here. I don't think you can. We have to go everywhere together. It's the law. And also the way the game mechanics work. Did you flip this one? I remember there being confusion about how some of these doors get opened. Oh. Yeah, I know that it was some combination of things we needed to flip. All right, everything's been flipped once. I think this opens the one up here, right? Nope. <laughs> sure doesn't. Watch out for the traps. up in between the pillars. Oh, those do not look sturdy at all. I'm just realizing these pillars they have holding the ceiling up are like dry stone bricks. Yeah, I think the webbing is more structural support than the, the pillars I think themselves. think so. That's like, that's like a Jenga tower waiting to fall. There's another game I've not played in a long time. Although, that mostly on purpose. Jenga is a terrifying game. Not as bad as Perfection. I don't think I've played Perfection. If you have, you've blocked it out. <laughs> That's possible. Oh, you know what? There was, the last time I played... Well, I, we weren't playing Jenga specifically, but the last time we used a Jenga tower was... Um, 
friends of mine. I already went over this, and I think one of those switches was, yeah, this is the stone, stone path. Now we're good. And then there were some guys over here. And then it was... That was the end, right? There's like one or two guys Nobody in here. Nobody yet. He's coming back to me. A little slow. Maybe there were no guys. I remember we stopped there at the end of one play session. Because we were like, oh, this looks like another part of the game. Yeah, and then we came back the next time and it was like... It was nothing. <laughs> we were already at the end. Yeah, I think this is the end. Yeah, this takes us into town, I think. Exit to Levant. Let's go sell some stuff. Let's see if we got enough money for your skill. That is a convenient gameplay loop. <laughs> yeah, we were playing, um, I, I was I was at a friend's place pre, pre-pandemic. And, uh, actually I think that was the last time me and my friends all met face-to-face -to, -face to play games before all that happened. And, um... We were playing a, a T, one of that TP TRPG where every time you make like a bold move, you have to take another piece off the Jenga tower, and if it falls, you die. Nice. It was absolutely terrifying. We were playing like a zombie apocalypse, and the worst part was I didn't get to stay till the end because I had to take the last uh, public transport home. And we were still playing, and they said that if you have to leave and you want to make a heroic sacrifice. You can sacrifice yourself uh, to save the others, but you have to knock the Jenga tower over to make that happen, and I just couldn't bring myself to do it. So I just left, and I guess my 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 leaving didn't help anyone. If it's any consolation, I couldn't have done it either. It makes a loud noise, and I don't like loud noises, you see. You see, I had there's a logic to this. I didn't like the sound it was gonna make. <laughs> I had so much iron scrap. We can use that to make spikes for traps, right? Uh, yeah, but I don't think they can be used in the pressure plate trap. Oh, really? So should I just sell it? It's pretty easy to get hold of more iron scrap, right? Very much so. We can just break it down from weapons and stuff. I'll just sell it. Taking up space. I got all kinds of herbs and stuff I can give you in case you need them for potions. And if you don't need them, then you can sell them. I think that's it. Is this my shield? I remember once I accidentally sold my shield. I think I don't want to risk that. All right. Uh, two more gold bars. No, okay, that's an extra shield. I'm gonna sell that too. And that's a hundred, so actually... I have six gold bars that I can give you for your skill. And I'm sure you have stuff to sell as well. Indeed. Maybe mid doing so as we speak. As I speak. I just have a decision to make. You let me know how many you need. And I'll give them to you. Because we're partners and we're in this together, buddy. Oh, Meep has gone to sleep. Sleepy Meepy. I wish I could set up like a Meep cam with my spare webcam, but he's always in a different place. And if I try to move it around too much, there's too much risk that everyone will see the state that my apartment is in. I can't have that. Uh. This guy is just ready to chow down on that scroll, man. He is just like, finish up your business. I'm gonna take a big ol' honking juicy bite out of this scroll. Just the moment you're done, ugh. Oh. Again, he's, he's upset now. He's put it down, because clearly holding it right next to his face wasn't sending the message clearly enough. He's giving in. His arm's getting tired. 
As soon as we're done, though. As soon as we're gone. Ooh, these metal bars are, like, all swirly. Look at this. What kind of metal is that? Is that palladium? It's a metal, right? Mm-hmm. It's blue. So that's... Ready. Did you run out of... Did the... The... Bleh. The merchant run out of money? How's my gear looking? Pretty good. In good shape. Oh, you did a quest? Mm hmm To have a piece of armor crafted. Sweet. I just used up all my Hackmanite. Oh. Cool. Better to use it, right? Indeed. Had to carry it around. Your mask has got a big old smile on it. Sure. Mine doesn't. Mine is very stoic. Ooh, there's like a factory behind us spewing... <laughs> are we... Are we in an industrial place now? Is this like... This is the most industrial of the places. Goodness gracious. All the pollution. How many, how much, how much, how much gold do you need for your thing? Yes. <laughs> Does that mean all of it? Mm -hmm. Alright. Whatever you don't use, you can carry. Look at that, the gold is kind of blue as well. The six gold ingots behind you in the ground. Just sit in there. Let me set up this cook pot so that you can fart around with it. Oh yeah. While I, I go, uh... I'm gonna give you, uh... Oh, that's for me. Whatever of this you don't need, you feel free to sell. Wood. I'm gonna drop that as well. I got a lot of keys. I need a keychain. I'll be right back. This is a good place for farming money, though. Like, we did one run through that place, and we get 300. 300 plus. Took us all day. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> I don't think if there's anything I could use to buy, but... Not really. I have some stuff for the heat now. I could cook. Oh no, I need one more mushroom to make a mushroom bar. There's a food guy over here. Hey, yo, food guy. Got a mushroom? You got fancy stuff. I don't mind. How about you, other food guy? Are you food guy at all? No, you're just a you're just a guy. Strong box backpack. Is that what I have? No. The one I have is different. Trader backpack. Luxury tent, mage tent. Oh, there's better desert armor than what I have. Oh, maybe not. Oh no, that's the scare. It's because I'm comparing the scare of those. Ah, it's fine. I'm good. So today I um, I finished recording my hundred days in vintage story. Oh wow, really? Almost sixty hours of gameplay. 
in that one world. Finished day 100 today. It's gonna be really, really good. It was actually a really incredible set of 100 days, and I got really, really lucky with the world. Wait till you see. It's probably gonna take me two, three weeks, maybe a month to get it all edited together, though. I have like 150-something gigabytes of footage, which need to be condensed into at most two hours. I don't think I can get away with longer than two hours on a YouTube video. Or you could do it in four 25-day chunks. Nah. I think this type of video works best if it's just all in one. I can do it. There's, there's a lot of days where I'm just doing kind of grindy stuff. I don't know if the video is going to be successful. But, uh... If it is, I'll do more of them, because it was actually pretty cool to just be able to sit and play and not have to talk to viewers while I play, knowing that I'm just gonna cut it all down later with a pre-written script. But yeah, 60 hours is definitely the longest I've ever ever played one for one video. <laughs> it's gonna be weird now, because like all my spare time, whenever I wasn't working, or, you know, doing other life stuff. It was playing that. And now it's just done? It's been like five, five weeks, I think. 60 hours in five weeks. You get to enjoy your freedom. <laughs> well, now I gotta spend all my spare time writing a script. I kept notes for every day, but I'm gonna have to go back and look over all the footage as well, because I know I miss, I forgot stuff when I was writing notes down. It's gonna be a long process to write a script, then I gotta record it, edit the audio, then I gotta take all that footage, cut it down to fit the script. What's this? Fungal I made cleanser. You some food with the stuff you gave me. Oh, thank you. Actually, I can give you uh, some more mushrooms if you want. They're just common mushrooms, though. If you need any mushrooms for cooking stuff, I I'm one short to make a mushroom bar. I, w I would I would just use them for a mushroom bar. If I had another mushroom, so. All right, then. I'll just hold until I get another mushroom. Or till they rot. One way or the other. They're not much use for anything else, right? Stars are out again. We did pretty well. I only lost, like, burnt, like, an eighth of my health and stamina on that run. So, that was easier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> mm -hmm. What's what's the next part of our plan, then? There's nothing else we need I to do think... here, right? Ooh, thank you. Um, there is actually something we need to do. All right. Which is wait for my armor to be done. Oh, all right. How long is that going to take? We can go exploring. Yes. Okay. Uh, Flames. We are going to power nap. Power nap? Who doesn't love a good power nap? Except this power nap is going to be amazing. Are we going to sleep for like a week? <laughs> <laughs> no, but we'll sleep for at least a day without having to worry about food or hunger or anything. Alrighty. Hey, shirtless man's back with his oh, fucking hunk of meat. I'm his choosing Uggs. not to take that out of context. <laughs> He's got Uggs as well. Hey, is there, uh, is there a, a job opening wherever you work, buddy? Because <laughs> it looks like a pretty laid-back place. On, on second thought, I may not want to do what you do for a living, so. So do you want to sleep here, or do you want to sleep in our normal spot? I am up for wherever you feel like sleeping. If you want to stick with tradition, shove these people out of your way. <laughs> We'll sleep here, pretend we're camping. Ooh. 
I will set up the tents. You will set up the tents. Plural. Oh! Oh my goodness gracious. Wait, are these the plant tents? You, I actually have one of these uh, plant tents in my inventory. Is that what those are? Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. That is extremely cool. I like that. I'm a fan. I want to watch you lie down on it. <laughs> oh no, we have to do it together, don't we? Well, first you can, I mean, you can watch me get in it. Okay. Oh my goodness. That is the, I'm sorry, that is the least comfortable possible way you could sleep in this. <laughs> Um, we're just on the ground. We're just on the ground. I think I think I'm gonna repair for 22 hours and take a little nap. <laughs> I guess that's the longest we can sleep, huh? Yeah. This is wild. Oh, we're also we're already an hour in, if you can believe that. So if you need to take a a pit stop. Feel free. I'm actually good for once. I'm sure I'll regret that later, but... Yay! My armor's ready. Yay! So will these stay here? For a while. Alright. We'd, like, hire if, someone to come me, by and were, water them, if, fertilize them. If they were permanent, I would plant one at every single butterfly site. That's true. I suppose... Game balance and whatnot. Yay! Show me what you got. Oh, bam. Oh, it's beautiful. Hold on. Let you up. Oh, yes. You look very magical, if I may say so. You look like you look like a guy who knows magic. Yep, and it's also resistant. It's a little less resistant to physical, but it's resistant to electricity, frost, Ooh. fire, and gives me a damage bonus for ethereal and toxic. Dang. And reduces my mana cost. Spectacular. Hey, this is some pretty good armor. I'm glad you got it. I got this. Wow. And I got the big backpack and the dangly light. The dangly electricity light. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> That's I shocking. will say that this outfit makes... Because it, it has like a little collar on it. But it makes the back of my helmet look like an even taller additional collar. <laughs> So fancy. So fancy. Awesome. So now we can get the friggin' crap out of this place. The friggin' crap. So what I'm thinking is... Is that lady stealing a painting? What? Where? Oh. You shouldn't assume that she stole it. Might be her painting. I've never seen anyone transport a painting like that. <laughs> There's Ham Hercules looking stoic. Very nice. I think it's the Uggs that really make the outfit, though, if I can be honest. Yeah. Boots with the fur. And the fact that he just, like, shoves that haunch into his armpit <laughs> and through his back. <laughs> <laughs> beautiful. It's a beautiful man. All right. Um, do we want to make use of these plant things to make it morning before we run out? Or at least, like, closer to dawn, maybe sometime when it's not freezing or too hot out? I have no protection against the cold, so... Maybe to, like, here? And 
get the least harmful temperature as we run back through the desert. Plot-wise, I think we need to go back to the marshes, right? I believe so, yes. I had a quest there. I don't remember what it was. I think it was to go to a place and maybe find a thing or kill a dude. I could check. Find the bandit hideout on Spiraling Cliffs. Yeah, kill a dude. Find a place and kill a dude. Or a, a handful of, of dudes, I guess. In the hallowed marsh. Yes. Nothing more sacred than a swamp, baby. Swamps are very important, to be fair. Also, I think that's be... why they started calling them wetlands. Well, to be, no I looked, this, I looked into this, or I, I read something about this recently, and actually wetlands and swamps are not the same thing. And a marsh is also technically a different thing. Like, they're all very similar, but there's, like, specific differences depending on whether there's trees growing there and stuff like that. I don't remember which one is which, though. Alright. The hives look so cool at night. Yes, they do. I know we don't want to go there, but they do look cool. Alright. Oh, there's that bird that we tried and failed to kill. <laughs> you want to try again? Oh, that was actually pretty easy. Ooh. Check that out. It's almost rotten. Oh no, it's not. Okay. Iridescent flesh of a rare bird which increases when movement speed. Cool. Gotta make sure I cook that up before it goes bad. Alright, let's go! Roughly westward. Try not to get killed. Oh! Fight happening over there. Let's maybe lead them to it. Beetle up ahead. Assassin beetles and... Where are you? Some other sort of... Music is real nice. Ah. Don't want any trouble there, buddy. It's still so cold. I'm worried I'm going to catch a cold before the sun comes up. Uh, what's with the heat? I don't have anything against the cold now. I'll just... I really thought that it would be getting warm by now. <laughs> the sun is over the horizon. Hello, pretty hives. I'm guessing there will come a point where we have to go into the hives. Or to the hives. Maybe not into the hives. I know there was when I did the Levant quests, but uh, I've not done the monsoon quests. Seems likely it will be required. Why am I still so cold? Hey! Sun! Oh, Mr. Sun. Sun. Mr. Golden Sun. Please shine down on me. I am cold. Son of a- why? We should have fought those beetles that were setting things on fire. Maybe. How is the temperature still going down? I don't suppose you have wood to make a fire. I have plenty of protection against heat. Uh, hang on. 
desert being the one place where getting firewood might be kind of an issue. What if I put a fire rag on my weapon? I don't think that would work. Well, it should. What if you put a fire rag on your weapon and then hit me? Oh, no, you can't. There's no PvP. Here, put this on. Thank you. Yeah, that helped. And I look very fashionable. God, I look I look like a dweebus. I already looted it. Yeah, sorry. but that also increases your run speed. Hold on, hold on. Check this out. Come here. Now that my temperature's back to normal. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh yes. Oh yes. Yeah, I think so. I think so. How does this how does this compare to the scarab mask? It protects against poison instead of heat, and reduced stamina cost, but less impact yeah, resistance. Yeah, I'll, I'll, yes, thank you. Yes, yes, I will take this. Yes, yes. Where's the exit? Why are we? I feel like we took a wrong turn somewhat. I'm happy now. You saved me from no, we're, we're... from getting catching a cold because this game misunderstands how colds are caught. And now I have the coolest mask in the game. I don't know what other masks are in the game, but I guarantee you none of them is as cool as this. And now we're going to be hot. See a monster over there? Maybe. Is that a monster, or are those those uh, dead things that we see all over the place? That's a dead Scourge Beast. Is it safe? These things are so scary. I know we're good. they're all going to come back to life. I know it. No spoilers, but I know they're all going to come back to life. <laughs> There's no way these things are all over the map and they're not going to come back to life at the end of the game to kill them. It's like a Chekhov's arsenal. <laughs> God, that's terrifying, but yes, exactly. Ooh, do we have enough rations? I have... Oh, I need uh, one more. Well, we can make a campfire right by the exit like we did before. Do you, you don't have any? I have three. I think you need four, right? Well, then, here. Oh, you got enough? You got extras? You can kindly and generously say, share with me? Thank you so much. Now we both have five. Yay! And there's Twinsies. the bugs that set things on fire. Let's maybe go around these guys. I don't want to be set it on fire. It's just a personal preference that I have. This is another scary thing from a distance that can't hurt me. Yet! Honestly, if they don't come to life and try to kill us, as much as I don't want them to, I'm going to be disappointed. It's just, it's too... Like, what's the point of having them everywhere if they're not going to, if they're not going to do something? You know what I mean? I lost you. <laughs> Are you getting up to mischief over there? No, I'm just overburdened. Oh, what are you overburdened for? Uh, I picked up some stuff. <laughs> okay. We were just at the town. You weren't overburdened when we left the town, were you? No. What'd you pick up? Was it good? One of them was a, uh, uh, Alchemical kit. Okay. Back to the forest, which is for some reason right next to the desert. No, it's pretty far away. I suppose. What's in between? I want to see that. Come on, game. Monsoon and Sirocco. 
Oh. Oh, all my bread just rotted. I guess time passes when we're traveling, huh? There's this alpha dude here. I'm tempted to try to kill him because I got a recipe for the alpha something. I have all the other ingredients for it. Man, all that bread rotted? That stinks. This is almost done. I'm just going to eat that. I mean, I have no problem giving it a shot. Yeah? All right, hold up. Let's do it. You ready to backstab? I'm ready to oh, Benny please. Hill. I missed. You can do it. Oh, goodness. You dodged him into me. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't, didn't realize how close you were. Oh. That wasn't too bad, actually. We both took a hit or two. Raw alpha meat. Some antlers, some hides. All right. I'm satisfied. When we get back to our uh, cook fire, I'll make whatever the thing was. I don't remember what it was. Double cook. All better. Yay. I'm not, but I'll be all right. I'm still angry. Actually, Wait, you know what? I... I should eat this one. Before it goes bad, because it says it gives me extra stuff to go with this boon that I currently got. So let's find something to kill. Here, hold this. What's up? Kazite armor. Yay! Now we're both unburdened. Yay! Oh, I need to put better armor on. Speaking of which... Okay. Quick, before my boon runs out. Find something to murder. Roll uphill like a champion. Woo! We're heroes! We just killed an innocent animal. Like heroes do. There we go. Bandits. are going to be unburdened now. This one's got a uh, monostone and some termit pottage. That felt pretty good, to be honest. Actually remembering to use my skills is nice for a change. Why is she still holding her weapon? Give it to me. Now if only I could remember to use that elemental grab thing to catch Elemental attacks. I don't remember where we are. You know where we We're are? on the right path. Okay. I trust you. I figure you'd stop me if I was going the wrong way. Although sometimes you go the wrong way. That's very true. And I have to catch you, and sometimes neither of us realizes we've gone the wrong way. Oh yeah, here we are. <laughs> the pile of corpses. Sure. I remember this pile of corpses. Some of them still got stuff. Oh, you've got a bow. I'm going to take that. Because sometimes I wish I had a bow. Actually, I'm going to take In your fact, torch. In fact, that was like off. 10 minutes ago. Yeah. Scavenger Co. I can sell that. <laughs> Shiv Dagger. I can sell that. Probably not for much, but... No, Shiv, Shiv, you can't. Oh. Well, then I'm gonna drop it. I don't want this. <laughs> Enjoy your meal, sir. Oh, thank you. 
Should we go uh, make some sales? Indeed. Do some bartering. Get some coin. Catch some fish. Raw salmon and a larva egg. Come on over here. Another raw salmon. I always feel like I shouldn't say salmon jokingly. Because In case every, people take you seriously. Because every uh, every English student I've ever had has pronounced it salmon. <laughs> <laughs> because Czech is an entirely phonetic language, so they read everything the way it's spelled. So when you tell them actually it's pronounced salmon, they look at you like, come on. No, it's not. That would be ridiculous. Why would you spell it that way? You have to make a lot of apologies to uh, people learning English when they learn how to read. And um, there's no excuse. We have no excuse. English is a mess. What, what do you want me to tell you? English is a mess. <laughs> yes, it is. It's a mess. It it's been cobbled together from 15 different languages. It's a, a, a miracle that it exists at all. I think it'll end up being the international language due to the fact that every language has some part in it. Yeah. <laughs> it's a collaborative project, really. Hey, mushrooms. I can make a mushroom bar. Speaking of which, actually, could you set up a cooking pot? You've got the cooking pot, yeah. We got our, our double fires. I think it's hilarious that the fires never go out, or that the fire pits never go away. Like, you could cover the entire world with fire pits. Thank you. Alpha sandwich. No, there was something else. Was it this one? Ooh, certainly like that. No, there was something else that required alpha meat. Oh, it needed bread too, and I all my bread rotted. So hold up, I need to buy more bread. was it? Oh, the bread of the wild. That needs... Smoke stuff. Which grows over here. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say it grows all around town. Yeah. Now there's a patch right here. And it has restored since I was last here. There we go. Bread of the wild. Oh, maybe I should have made the other one that had the, the fancy... Well, too late now. How much has this got left? Do you know any good recipes that use the raw jewel meat? Besides the one that I just uh, couldn't make because I... Spicy. Um... Right. Nothing that expressly uses it, except for cooked jewel meat. Yeah, maybe I'll just do that. Seems more useful than just throwing it in a stew, right? Oh yeah, because in a stew you lose the speed, the exactly. speed boost. Alright, um... Yeah, plenty of that. And cooking... Cooking it moves, moves the spoil time from four days to 19. Also a good call. Um, do you want the salmon for anything? You were making something with salmon before. Uh, rainbow trout. I don't have any seaweed, though. You needed seaweed, too, right? 
I'm gonna drop a salmon here in case you need him, because I'm not gonna use him for anything. I'll drop a few things that I'm not gonna use. Oh, I'll be dang. I think I don't need to cook anything else up. No. Oh, actually, we're gonna need more travel rations, right? Assuming we are going to uh, the Hallowed Marsh, yes. Even if we don't go right away, that stuff lasts for ages, and we'll use them eventually. Ooh, I gotta get away from the fire, I'm getting hot. Oh, this mask is so cool! I'm real happy about it. All right, do I have any food that's about to spoil? The gay berries are, but... Cactus fruit is about to spoil. Wait, we had a, a pack over here. Food doesn't rot when it's in packs, um, right? No, how many cactus fruit do you have? Two. You want them? They're about no, to rot. But, uh, cactus fruit, cactus fruit, bread. Okay. Cactus pie. Dish of invigorating cactus fruit and bread that helps against the heat when eaten. Awesome. I'll put any heat resistant stuff in this pack. Right? So that if we're heading back to the desert, we'll almost certainly be stopping here. It'll be waiting for us, yeah? Is that logical? Yes. So we're not going anywhere hot right now. Let's put the heat in the just not keep that. some stuff to sell. Oh, uh, the Kazite armor. You want that? Should I put um, it in the, in the pack? Yeah. Okay. Will do. Don't actually have anything to sell, really. Just all the hides. Easy enough to get more. I'll put my scarab mask in there. And yeah, should I put my hot weather gear in there as well? Because we're not going anywhere hot, right? No, we are not. Planning. Planning for the future. All right. I think that's all the inventory management I need to do for now. We look so cool. We are cool. We are cool. I keep putting my foot up on the, on the curb. <laughs> I'm not touching anything, it just keeps sort of glitching up there. Bloop, bloop. Do you want to go up? Do that? No. <laughs> okay. I've had my fun.
if I saw someone coming at me wearing this mask, I would piss my pants instantaneously. Like, before I even realized I had piss to piss my pants with, my pants would be wet. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I feel like I should get a bonus to my combat. I feel like it would make logical sense for me to be better at fighting. As long as I wear this mask. Like, there should be a chance that my enemies would just be like, no, screw this, and they just turn and run away. Although, I don't know if I would actually like that. It's kind of a pain to chase down those birds. Yeah, it is. I came over here to put something in the bag, and I don't remember what it was. I do. <laughs> Doing like a haka over here. I don't know how to do a haka. I just think they're cool. Indeed. It's a real neat cultural thing that the Maori have got. Along with my respect. Oh, I've got to figure out um, where my other trainers are, right? I think one is right here. I think you're right. Yes. And I've got all the skills from him. Unless I want both skills. Which I could do. Sniper um, shot's not I have a bad a, idea, actually. Uh, I have... One gold bar and 49 silver, which is enough to buy the the two skills that he has if you have one silver. I have 10 silver. I don't know if I need the evasion shot, actually. I think I just want the sniper shot. I'm never going to use this. Well, I picked up the silver and you can just have the gold ingot. Oh, I need to sell it. Will you buy it? Yeah. Give me some cash. Like, it's a good skill, but given how all of my skills, my hot bar slots are already used up all the time. Alright, I got sniper shot. I gotta remember that I have that, because I don't have any place to put it and just keep it. I guess I could put it where the water is now. I don't need that there. Yeah, I mean, the water we really only needed there for when we were going to be on fire. So the sniper shot will be, like, something that I only need to use at, like, before the start of a fight, when we're going to pick a fight with someone from a distance. Oh, you found me. I can see. I can see your health bar, and also there's a compass at the top of my screen pointing at you. <laughs> yeah. Right. We're going to the Hallowed Marsh. Head onward. Do we need a nap first? I don't have too much hey. too much burn. Do you want to? There's. We with it. Let me start again. There might not be a whole lot of time to run all the way to Monsoon. Right. Do you want to fart around here, kill some stuff, probably die, nap, died and then call it? We could do that, yeah. Why not? Let's go murder some dudes. In and around their base. Yes. Good to be precise. We could go try to fight that giant again. I don't know if that's wise though. <laughs> it's 
been a while since we've been out this way. Somebody over there. Oh, that's another alpha dude. Coral horn. That's the one. You want to go for it? Why not? All right, hold up. Locked onto the wrong one. Let me buff. And jump attack. Get the fuck out of the way. <laughs> nice. Did you get a backstab in yet? Yes. There you go. Wow. No hits taken. We are strict. Oh, I wanted that horn. I'm oh, just kidding. you can have it. I just picking it up because I had the bigger backpack. There you go. With two horns and a recurve bow, I can make you a good bow. Oh, cool. Should we take out these little ones too, or I feel kind of bad? They're not. They're not doing any harm. Yeah, they're not. They're not messing with anybody. Not that this guy was either. <laughs> but he would have. He would have. He was giving us a sign. Theoretically. Eye. It was a preemptive self-defense, right? <laughs> He's coming right for us. I saw him. Hey, it's just video, James. <laughs> it's all right. I hear combat music. Is that just adventure music? It might just be nice robust exploration music. Could be. It could be. Something over there. It's dude shaped. That's the giant. Do we go for it? Hold up. Let me beef myself up with something here. Increase frost damage. Alright. Are we gonna do this? Apparently. Now's the time. I got my rage boon. I'm doing it. Ow, poison gas. Go. Woo hoo hoo! It's got a big swing. Gonna keep kiting him. Oh! Oh! I wasn't expecting a double swing. Poison! Oh, he's on you, he's on you. Okay, he's on me again. Nice! Big, but he's slow. Yes! <laughs> we did it! You okay? You took a couple I hits there. Be. Astral potion, endurance potion. I'm gonna take the endurance potion. I'm always running out of max stamina. Palladium and a life potion. I'm gonna take the life potion because you've got your healing magic thing. Yes. Holy crap. That was pretty good, actually. Yeah, it did. I'll take a bread of the wild. Oh, my uh, rage boon is gone. We're a good team. Of course your rage boon is gone. You're happy. <laughs> I'm too excited. Let's go find other things to murder. <laughs> well, give me a little bit of time to heal. I mean, I guess I could use a potion if we find something too good. Yeah, you're also assuming I'm going to find something very quickly. We usually don't have too much trouble finding stuff that wants to kill us, to be fair. 
Oh, it's raining. It's raining inverted color strips again. It's, I mean, it's got to be an easy way of making it visible and yeah, I mean, it doesn't look bad. Yeah, I mean, it certainly reads as rain. I just find it kind of amusing because it is, if you look for more than half a second and you know anything about how, you know, colors in video and stuff work, it's very clearly that they've just inverted bits of the color. Hey. Which is why it's very, you can, if you look through the rain at the clouds, where you're very close to like 128, 128, 128. Yep. And the inverse doesn't really change. You get invisible rain. I have a I've lost track of what? where we even are, so that's fun. Me too, but my brain is telling me things. Oh. Anything good? My brain or... I don't know. My brain is just saying this is a this is a place. We could go fight the other giant at the um tower thing. At the big harp? That killed us yeah, whatever it was. There was a big thing and there was a big giant forever. That killed us a couple of times. We might be able to take it now, although I should wait for my boon to regen. Well, I can. I thought I saw the vigil pile on a second ago. Yeah, it was uh, to the northeast, east. It's kind of blocked by the trees. It's gone very quiet, freaking me out a little bit. We'll be fine. <laughs> it's quiet. Too quiet. Okay, so you said the vigil pylon is east. Yeah. Roughly. Which means the big harpsichord is west. Okay. That way. Well, there's a cliff in front of us. That's not going to be very helpful. There's a big rotted hollow log here. I feel like there should we... be something good in here, and it doesn't look like there is. <laughs> you just feel that way because you're a mushroom. Yeah. Maybe. Alright, come on game. Put some music back on. I was feeling powerful and heroic. The trees... <laughs> Can you see on, on my stream how the trees just look like blobs? <laughs> just... Like watercolor splotches. Hey, it works though. I haven't. Like, I don't think I've had any drops. Watercolor frames. acrylics. Watercolor acrylics. <laughs> I used to paint. It's one of the many hobbies I kind of had to let go because I just don't have enough time for all my hobbies. Is that it right there? I see steps. I don't know. Well, I mean, I see the the place to the west. Vigil pile on. So yeah, this would have, this would be it. All right. There's a dog up there, one of the robo dogs, on the cliff. I don't think this is where we fought before. It had less of a of a build up to get up to it. Maybe it was somewhere. Oh no, it wasn't the Cabal of the Wind Temple. Yeah, that's where we're going. Oh, okay. Just up a cliff? Why not? I guess it's not a cliff. Here. Alright, I've got my uh, boon ready again. Okay, yeah, I see it now. Now I see it! Oh! Oh! I see it. Popping in in the distance. <laughs> My low render distance. All right, no, it's got to be pretty close here, right? Yeah, hold so on, I'm hold like... on. Let me let me check my items. Uh, max stamina. 
Increases your weapon's impact and gives you the possessed and discipline boons. Yeah, that's the one I want. So as soon as we see the giant... I don't think it was up here. Wasn't it down below? Yeah. Came from a different uh, direction last time. I feel like... There's... Like, I know there's something around here, but I don't see it yet. So I am unnerved. <laughs> My nerves, they're undoing themselves. Yeah, it wasn't up here that we fought that guy, for sure. Oh. What's up there? Uh, anemone face. Oh. Little baby one. Well, we can probably take that. Just Two one? anemone faces. Hold up, let me. I'm not even gonna use my boon. There's another one behind you, careful. too bad i don't think we took any hits i did i got caught in a, oh. a blast that i couldn't avoid can you heal yourself up with these guys or do you need humanoids i i only need humanoid to regain the mana but i have enough mana now to actually affect healing sweet do your magic where was the giant that's gonna drive me nuts we're... Are we here? It was, was it the Lonely Tower? I feel like it was this one. Maybe on the other side? Maybe it was at the Vigil Paimon. Maybe. maybe. Ooh, that's an immortal. I think it was at the Vigil Paimon, actually. An immortal? Wait, what? That doesn't sound good. Is an immortal a thing that we can fight and win? Or is it a friend? We're gonna find out. Are we? <laughs> I guess we're not fighting a giant today. Oh. Hi there. You are a giant. Just a different variety of giant. Are we going down? Okay, hold up, hold up. Let me... I'm gonna take this. All right. Are we sure it's not friendly? Mm -hmm. Seems seems unlikely it would be friendly. Are you ready? It looks like it's stuck. Two seconds. Tell me when. I'll try and kite it. So you can get your backstab in. <laughs> it's just standing there. Well, moonwalking. before my boon runs out. All right, okay. Ready? Yeah. All right. Come on, lock on. There we go. All right, it's on me. I think. Oh no, it's on you. Okay, now it's definitely on me. Ooh. Hey there, buddy. in the backswing. Dang. Hey, it hit me while I was dodging. While I was in, like, mid-roll. Are you dead? No, kite him a sec. I'm trying. All better. Okay. 
Eesh. Not a lot of room to like. Uh, once he's pissed off at me, uh, go run, drink a potion. Uh. Okay. Uh, potion, 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 potion. Okay. Man, he's real good at like. Mmm. Yes. Yes. Immaculate, not immortal. Immaculate. Wow. <laughs> That was rough. Teamwork! Yep, but we didn't panic. We stayed calm and we beat its ass. We did. We did do that. And now it's getting dark and we're just about out of time. So we should probably head back to town and... um. I can't pick up its weapon. That's not fair. Surely that would sell for a lot. Same thing with the giant. I couldn't pick up its weapon. I know they're big and heavy, but like, you know... I'm carrying a lot of big and heavy stuff. I mean, I can make... I mean, you can make something out of the thorny cartilage he dropped. There's a claymore and a spear. Hold on. There, there's supposed to be a totem. I guess it's not here. Okay. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right. You need to activate all the totem things, right? Let me see if I've already done it here. You might have. I must have, because I was able to use that buff. Okay. So, we're here, yeah? We need to head east and then north. Yep, east down the cliffs and across some bridges. Cool. Are you with me? I'm right behind you. Ah. <laughs> Stupid Xbox 360 gamepad. How did we get up here? It was back this way. Yeah? This way. Yeah. What's up here? <laughs> we both just have the same thought. Is there loot? This looks like there would be loot here. There's palladium. Ooh, I got it. Because I repaired my pick. Remember? And I do. We. We gotta watch out down here because there's one of those robot dogs on the cliff. I see it there. It's on the steps now. We don't need to fight that, yeah? No. I mean, it's worth like 22 silver. Well, we can yeah. fight it if you want. We, we killed them when we were still newbies. Let's fight it. Heck it. One last fight. Uh, I'm a little low on health, actually. Okay. Part of the wild. Where'd it go? Oh, it's over here. It's on me. Yeah, this guy's a weenus. Ow! I was wrong! Less of a weenus than I believed. Beast golem scraps and palladium spikes. You can take the spikes, obviously. Alright. Get back to town. My eyes are starting to go funny with the darkness here with my uh, ring light next to the monitor. <laughs> my eyes do not like the ring light. I can turn my beacon on. I've got my lamp on already. It's this way, yeah? I'm just running 
kind of northeast-ish until I hit water and then turning <laughs> east. That works. Unless we hit a cliff, and then it works less well. Nope. <laughs> Oh, I'm cold. Hold on, I've got something for that, haven't I? And no, no, I don't actually. I do. I'll take it. What do we got? Ah, yes, that's the one. Thank you. You know those ochre spice beetles? Yes. I keep getting them for Boil you. them up with some water. That's it? Yep. Can you do it in a cooking pot? Yes. Well, for some reason, I was thinking the teas were made I in think. the uh, alchemist thing. But perhaps not. There's another alpha down there. I think we can let that one live. That actually may be the same one, right? Or like it's respawn. not moving a whole lot. Maybe it's sleeping. Where are we? <laughs> Bridge. Bridge. Home. Hey, I hit E. What does E do? It's the dodge that gives me the discipline buff. Oh. <laughs> Not the dodge, the block. Oh yeah, I get that. I never use it. Alright. We're on that island in the middle of the lake. A dungeon here. Maybe next time. Tree husk. <laughs> Did we both just veer off towards the chest at the same time? Yep. <laughs> oh, there's stuff for you in here. You take that room, isn't it? Actually, did you get it all? Okay, good. Mm -hmm. I need to make up some new bandages next time. I gotta remember to do that. There's the entrance to the town east. Or actually, we can go. Over there. Yeah, we'll we cross forward. this bridge, go a little east, and then north, and we're in Berg. Yeah. Again, it's so quiet. I feel like games should never, the music should never stop unless you turn it off. Unless it's for purposefully thematic reasons. Yeah. There's so many games where, like, they just program the music to play sometimes. Stardew Valley does that. It drives me nuts. Because it has, like, really happy, upbeat music, and then suddenly it's just silent. And nothing makes you feel more, like, alone. <laughs> and, like... Mm -hmm sad than when there's upbeat music that suddenly stops. Vintage Story does the same thing. I, I don't I don't put the music... Vintage Story has beautiful, wonderful music in it, and I can't have it enabled because there'll just be these long periods of silence that make me depressed, so I just have to turn the music off completely and listen to something else. 
And then when I record for videos, I turn the music off. And then I have to put the music... <laughs> that's funny. I have to put the music back in in editing. Manually. So that the video sounds good. A little behind the scenes information about making videos. It's a lot of audio work. Alright, you. I think I have a little bit of stuff to sell you. Not much. Keep it that. Maybe not. <laughs> Oh, I've got the alpha meat, though. Uh, beast golem scraps. Sell them. Okay. Selling them. Uh, I got gravel beetle, and... Anything else I'm keeping, I think. Most of the stuff that they drop was actually, like, useful. Um... You want to throw the cooking pot up, so I can use this, uh, alpha meat before I forget about it? I know we need to take a nap. And we need to end. Oh my goodness. Two hours goes by real fast sometimes, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Sometimes I think I should just get a cooking pot, and then I think, well, that would be stupid. Both of us carrying Sometimes that. I think we should just leave a cooking pot in each town. That's also a possibility. All right, there's three alpha sandwiches to be used for combat next time. To give you one or two of those as well. Um, gravel beetle plus water, you say? Gravel beetle plus water will give you the mineral. Let me make sure. Yeah. Um, that'll give you the mineral water or mineral tea, which will, in, which will restore some burn health. Okay. Is that the only use for the gravel beetles? Uh, no. Gravel beetle, blood mushroom, and water in an alchemy gives you health potion. Well, that seems more useful, so I'm going to drop the gravel beetle and let you do that. What was the one that you said? Is it the other type of beetle? Ochre spice beetle. Ochre spice beetle, okay. Gotcha. Alright, I think I'm all set then. I got a lot of salt. Oh, actually... To make some bandages. Hi, Yavik. Hi, Yavik. You've come just in time for the end of the stream, I'm afraid. <laughs> we did well today, though. We didn't die all day. The whole stream. And I got this kick-ass mask. And you got the last skill you needed from... The... From Levant. Bandit, dude. And we killed a giant and an immaculate. Immaculate? And no. yeah. And two of the uh big honkin deer. Yeah. We've so done we, real we well today. Here yeah, we good. Dropping my pack. Oh, time for a nice Relaxing sleep. I don't know how long I need to sleep to get back that much health. That should work for me. That good for you? Yeah. We've done real, real well. It's almost like we're getting better at this game. I know. Like a little bit, maybe? Maybe? <laughs> Meep just woke up. Sat up from where he's been sleeping on the couch and just looked at me with this look of annoyance, like, still, are you still streaming? And then went, <sighs> and went back to sleep. <laughs> it's all right, buddy. I'm going to play with you in a few minutes. Just about done. That was two very successful streams in a row. I'm starting to worry. We're setting, we're setting the bar too high. <laughs> <laughs> Although, I mean, part of it is just like, we have skills and we're remembering to use them, or at least I am. 
And I finally remembered to start, like, checking my potions and stuff before every battle and use those items. That made a big difference, too, I think. Mm -hmm. And your fancy robes. And my kick-ass mask. Did I mention my mask? Oh, Bye. All right. Go back to the main menu. Come on now. Well, thanks for having me. Thank you so much for playing with me. This has been extremely good. Um, hopefully next week. Again. Same bat time, same bat channel. <laughs> yes. All right. Uh, say bye, Kronk. Bye, Kronk. <laughs> bye. Uh, no, I don't want to do a thing, Discord. I don't want to fill out your little survey. All right. Um, yeah, that's it. Thank you, everyone, so much for hanging out. Uh, this was a really good one. Um, so if you want to watch more Outward, hopefully next Saturday will be the same. Uh, we started uh, two hours and 15 minutes ago. So that's our start time, whatever your time zone is. And on Wednesday, I should be streaming more and hopefully finishing Human Resource Machine. And I would greatly appreciate as much help as possible on that. So stop by for that if you can. And uh, that's all I had to say. Bye!